Hey all, and welcome to Real Little Britain. Folks, tonight i got another beer for you. This one comes from the Dorset Pedal Brewery, and it's their number one lager beer, coming at 4.3% ABV. This is a new beer. I think it's been launched in the last uh, month, month and a half, maybe two months. Looking very, very good. I'm really looking forward to trying this. So it comes with a, a nice uh, silver top on it. It has got a little bit of a dent, but hopefully that's not going to impact too much on the beer. Um, as always, BB Bar Time. Let's crack this bad boy open and let's see what this beer is like. So this beer has been chilled for about 24 hours. So straight in with the pour. This beer is pouring with low carbonation. Um, and it's actually poured very much like a, an eel. It's a half a finger head, which is pure white in colour. But look at that, folks. That is clear. How clear is that? Unreal. That, do you know the clarity in this beer? It reminds me of a lot of brewery beer. Because all their beers are clear too. Look at that, folks. As you can see, you can see the mighty Arsenal. Yeah, Arsenal FC. Look at that. It's a nice golden colour with a tint of lemon to it. So let's go straight in with the nose. Oh, do you know the first thing I'm getting is? I'm getting a little bit of banana. And then there's lemon. There's a little bit of very light golden syrup. There's some apple blossom. And a little bit of white bread. But the strange thing is there's there's like a banana note on it as well. Okay, let's go straight in with the taste. Cheers. Oh. Oh, yes. The first thing you're getting is you're getting quite a sweet maltiness. Which just then disappears to really light, crisp bitterness. It's like a proper pilsner. We'd be surprised if there's some type of bohemian hops used or malts. There's wheat present, there's a little bit of golden syrup, there's nice lemon notes, there's a tiny, tiny bit of white grape. There's peaches, there's apple blossom. Oh, this is good. This is really good. The only thing which is lacking in this beer for a, for a lager is carbonation. But maybe it's because it's been really, really chilled down. You're not getting it. But I'm enjoying this. This is definitely something I would like to have with a curry or a really nice fish and chips or scampi and chips sitting on the beach skull and knees oh very good what is really starting to dominate is the kind of the white grape the sweetness mm. very very good you're also starting to get this nice earthy green hoppiness bitterness starting to develop a mixture between green leaves and green grass. Boy, this is fresh. This is fresh. So what's the finish like? The finish is fruity with a really nice citrus notes uh, follow through with this. And it's quite unique for lager this fresh green grass bitterness with greeny kind of leaves bitterness as well folks what do I give um, Dorset Pedal Brewery for their number one lager beer at 4.3% I want to try this on cask or keg 
because I think this could be a really big beer. It's a 9 out of 10, folks, a 9 out of 10. <coughs> Ooh. Nice burp. Just on that, I think the mouthfeel in this beer as well is very, very good. So, it's a type of beer, stroke lager, which would get lager drinkers to drink ale. Because, for me, it's more of that ale nature, but it's got that lager taste. Very good indeed. Uh, folks, that's really the Britain. Doing a review on Dorset Pedalburys, number one. Um, lager beer at 4.3%. Cheers. Slam a